okay, Walker? You've been awfully quiet. Just thinking about our next move. Want to share your thoughts with the rest of us? Well, from what we've heard, I'm starting to think the 33rd went to war against itself. Whichever side won, seems they decided to stay here and take over Dubai. Sounds like a mess. It is. The CIA's been here for God knows how long trying to clean it up. Long enough to know everything that's going on in the city. Including what happened to Conrad? Because if they got out to international about what happened when an American general and a whole entire army battalion. What's wrong? I'm, uh, I'm picking up something. You guys need to hear it. Patch it through. If it gets through to the United Nations, what, that, what an entire battalion has done. You're full of shit. They don't send the CIA to look for survivors. That's enough, Luger. Yes, sir. Can you trace the signal's origin? I already did. It's coming from over there. This. At least we know one agent is still alive. More than one, actually. If the 33rd's broadcasting this shit, it's for a reason. You think it's bait? It hooked us. Oh, uh, this is gonna be an epic shot, whatever it is. Oh my god. That is god Signals coming from damn beautiful. We are standing on glass. Long line. Time to reel it in. You know this is a trap. Absolutely. The whole city's gone crazy. Daniels might be our only hope of sorting this mess out. Follow me. We just have to sit here and listen to this dude get tortured? Oh, that's clearly not fucking ominous right there. Oh, I shouldn't have let them. It's they're human. This is the worst. They're they're humanizing the people you're fighting, and that's the worst thing that can happen to anyone. Because we just received word from the tower. Go ahead, Corporal. Operation Reclamation has suffered max casualties. Hold your fire until I give the word. No longer a threat. Remaining Gray Fox members in vicinity. Gray Fox. What about the civilians? Did we get them out in time? Some. Mm. Maybe 40. We don't know yet. God damn it. Give them. For they know not what they do. Oh. Tell the tower we are already broadcasting. We're ready for this. Yes, sir. Corporal, has Lieutenant Bradley reported in yet? No, sir. Go check the stairwell. See what's holding them up. Yes, sir. Hostile down! What if I was quick enough? This could have been an entirely stealth. Holy shit! They're literally just funneling in. But humanizing... You don't want the dudes you're fighting... You don't want to know that they have families or, or dreams or aspirations or that they... Like, these dudes were running a camp and murdering people. I was convinced that these dudes were Nazis. And I was okay with murdering them wholesale. Now I feel bad. Because it turns out that they haven't gone crazy. Some of them, while maybe what they're doing is bad, they have judged it and they have given themselves enough reason to not... They're not Nazis. They're not aliens. They're real people who 
just lost half his face. Who have come to a reason that in order for peace, stability, and eventually getting home, they have to do these things. And now, especially murdering those two dudes, I feel really bad. And I'm dead again. Because I'm a dumbass. But, yeah, what, that's some kind of weird, like, Brazilian feather-haired lady thing going on there. Oh, I'm going to have to do murder all these dudes again. Yeah, see, it's like, look, they have compassion. They still have morals. They, they're kind to each other. They're not just sitting around talking about, like, how I'm going to murder dudes or whatever. Major, we just received word from the tower. Go ahead, Corporal. Operation Reclamation has suffered max casualties. Hold your fire until I get... Tango down! Stop down moving! Heads up! Watch it, they're moving! Put your goddamn head down! That's the last thing you want. I'm sorry, I was concentrating on enemy positions here. That dude's flanking, that dude's flanking, that dude's flanking, that dude's flanking. What? Oh my god, it takes forever to reload a man. Need decent cover. I'm gonna get over here and flank them. It's... Okay, this took a whole new turn. Again, I thought I was fighting Nazis. I'm not. I'm fighting dudes with, like, hopes and dreams and shit. And this makes it way harder for me to murder you wholesale like you're Nazis. Which I'm still gonna do, because you guys are assholes. I'd like to point out that we have not come across, like, we haven't come across the child murder room. Or the, 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 the rape, like, the place where we keep the, the women that we rape, you know? Like, we haven't come across, like, the, the rape Walmart, or the, or the children murder house, or the, or the, or the body dismemberment for shits and giggles department, you know? Watch yourselves! Right. So, I mean, these dudes are doing some fucked up shit, but they're not comedically evil. But they are stupid, and they do funnel like a goddamn bunch of flies. Someone's obviously calling the shots around here. It's gotta be the guy on the radio. Shit. You think? It would explain why Dubai's gone bad shit. Good point. CIA Op Squad, codename Gray Fox. Known members include Thomas Daniels, Brian Castevan, Jeff Riggs, and Rick Gould. Jeff Riggs is a great the name. The of Daniels has revealed CIA to be responsible for attacks on our outposts throughout the city. CIA attacks have been aided by members of local populace, heretofore referred to as insurgents. Ooh, that's... Oof. Insurgents believed to be operating directly outside our territory. The word we give to people who Daniels we just don't like. ...has revealed possible location of stronghold. Raid has been scheduled with intent to neutralize CIA threat and establish order in the area. If all else fails, recommend use of Daniels to lure other CIA members into the open. Oh, th so can I rely on the CIA? Is that something I can do here, game? Can, like, I team up with the CIA? With oh, no, they hated us. God damn it. It's like we're literally, the CIA don't trust us because we're wearing the uniform, and the other guys don't trust us because we're not wearing the correct uniform. This is a long way down. Hold up. Got snipers. Fucking hide, then. Oh, shit. Whoa, whoa. I should not probably have engaged this like this. 
Oh! Oh, this is this will probably be good. I wish there was like a way to go in between cover. We go. Damn it! Where's that? I see the laser, but I don't see where the dude is who's hot. The... Oh, there he is! Damn it. Oh, come on! Damn, that was a nice shot. Got you. Don't got you. You're dead. I think we're clear. Let's move up. Keep your eyes peeled. Let's cross over. Move. move fast, stay low. Shit. Oh. Incoming helo. I hear it. She's a big bitch, ain't she? Yeah. And her friends know exactly where we are. Now get ready. They're headed right for us. All right. Here we go. Alright, so if they have a helicopter, that, that means... Oh, shit. If they have a helicopter, that means that they have a fuel depot somewhere. And access to a fuel depot. Fuck your leg up, man. You got you. Ah, shit. Oh, oh, uh 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 oh. Okay, we're good. Oh, that's not good. Went upstairs, which means there's a door here. Nowhere. God damn it. Fucking son. Oh, hell yeah, I can use you. Give me. That was a bit of a delay, but okay. Further and further we go along, the more and more the blurred lines become AI, between AI and insurgent, I mean, uh, uh, god damn it, uh, soldier and insurgent become. Some of them are starting to wear insurgent, yeah. Look <laughs> at that dude! So give me you, and then I'll take you. God damn. Yeah. 
Come on, come on. This is nuts, dude. It's, it's literally like horde mode. It's literally just wave after fucking wave after fucking wave. And we keep moving. Jesus Christ, how many dudes are we going to murder? Question answered. All of them? More speakers. How many men did you bring here, Agent Daniels? No, I'm done answering questions. You have to let me speak to Conrad. Oh, really? <laughs> so, so crazy DJ man isn't actually. How long do you think Daniels can hold out? Not much longer. And here I was thinking he was Conrad. All right, so where are we going? Oh, uh oh, that's where we're going. So I can totally tell you that this long, arduous bridge is going to be nothing at all dangerous. It's going to be a total cakewalk! Now, I do appreciate it, but I do not believe hanging off one hand like a badass was done in military training. Especially in the army. I know Delta Force are awesome. Oh, wow, that dude... Oh, yeah, dude. Did you guys see that knife-wielding dude? It is clear that they're... That, uh... That... Yeah, these crazy dudes with a knife. It is clear that some of these dudes have just lost it. And they're just blending in perfectly with the guys who haven't lost it, who are talking about sharing gum. Or maybe it's because they were normal. Like, they, the fact that they were normal. And talking about normal things like sharing gum is the antithesis that they have actually gone completely nuts. Kind of like the idea that sanity in a place of complete insanity is proof of insanity? weird. I don't know. I'm not a psychologist. It, it may just be that people are so fucking... God damn it. People are so just desperate for some norm, normal, normalcy, normalcy, that they j It's... I don't even know. It's... This is seriously fucked up. Hostile down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fuck you, man. Fuck it. Sniper. Focus on that sniper. Watch it, Lord, baby. Watch it, shotgun are coming in. Hostile down. Target is down. Hostile down. That's all. But now, holy shit! Did you guys see that sniper with the knife? Yeah. There were like three or four of them. Guy like that could fuck you up. Alright, let's hurry up then. We need to find Daniels before the 33rd decide he isn't worth the trouble. Also, I really like that they actually talk about the one psychopathic enemy that was different. The one enemy that needed to be talked about was talked about. That reflective surface is awesome. What was that? And that face is creepy. And... Go, go, go. 
This torture sounds a bit extreme. How about with the radio man running the show? It's not that hard to believe. How you pick him? I actually think I met him once. In Kabul. He was a reporter traveling with the 33rd. Weird guy. Kind you didn't want loose in a firefight. Never spoke to him, but the colonel trusted him completely. Couldn't figure out why. Looks like that trust finally caught up with him. So what makes you think he's the same guy? Oh, it's his voice. You don't forget a voice like that. No, so you don't. Shit. We gotta go further down. Who I am. Let him go, Nabil. That's right. Hands off the goods. You have 30 seconds. Tell me what you want. What I want, <laughs> what I want is you, man, on record, telling me about the genocide you and your friends are trying to keep hidden from the rest of the world. <laughs> yeah. Magnus, you have no idea what you are saying. Get him out of here. Oh, yeah? Well, <laughs> I'll tell you what I know. I know the truth, man, and the truth is where it's at. I know every expat and fat cat Emirati hightailed it out of Dubai on permanent vacation two days before your office shit-canned a news piece about the storm. <laughs> yeah, and I know your wife and kids left this morning, and I know your mistress is leaving town tonight. What a You know nothing of Dubai, my friend. If you did, you would know the truth is whatever we wish it to be. Any evidence you find to the contrary will never change that. Get out of my office. You can't hide the truth, man! So, God damn it, he was actually on to something, and the, the general trusted him, and he obviously went ballistic and just fucking nuts, and then he convinced the general to go nuts, too. Love me some bad water guitar. Oh, this looks like a private room. Yep. The secretary. Or the man himself. Dude was in love with himself, wasn't he? Was that the guy shot behind his desk, or was that the secretary? Now let's find a way out of here. I think it might have been him. It was just one room. Also, I don't know if you guys have noticed. Have you guys noticed that the like the friendly banter and the jokes have stopped completely? They there's no more. It's just all business now. There is no more jokes or anything. It's all this is fucked. Uh Ooh. Uh, dude, 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 grab, grab, grab it, grab it, grab it, jump off, jump off, jump off, oh, ow! Grab the flagpole, grab the flagpole. Oh, that was slick thinking, dude. I don't know how that just didn't, like, break your fucking spine in half. Keep going down. Completed. Well, that was an easy goal.